Yeah. Um, so in this one exactly, again, they're asking us to find the zeros. So we replace this with 0. Therefore, now it's already in factored form, so I apply the zero product property. So I have x minus 2 equals 0, and x plus 7, e or x plus 7 cubed equals 0. Now you just go ahead and solve for x. So you add 2 to both sides, x equals 2. Take the cube root of both sides, x plus 7 equals 0. right? Because the cube root of something cubed goes to 1. Now you just go ahead and solve. So subtract 7, subtract 7, x equals negative 7. However, we need, they also ask us to look at the multiplicity. So this, you both look at, before you look at multiplicity, make sure both factors are linear, which they are. And then you look at the power of each factor. Well, the powers of my factors are 1 and 3. Since both of my um, zeros have a multiplicity that is odd, we know that they're going to cross at both of those zeros. Correct? And that's it. <laughs>